And so anything that he had to say, I, I kind of had to take it with a grain of salt. Again, I hope that he does get help. Furthermore, um, I noticed that we have somebody here from, I think, one of the pedophile groups. I would like to say the following. All right, this is not about hampering dialogue on this very important matter. You know, pedophilia has been an element of civilization since civilization began. Certain people have inclinations. I think they're going to have to control their inclinations. Um, I will tell you, in my investigation in this case, it has led me to a very dark world. Uh, there is material out there which taps into your primordial sense about protecting children. And so the fact is, is that if there are certain inclinations, I think that they should be subject to being talked about. Uh, however, we have a duty to kids here. And when there's potential harm to children, no one's going to put up with that. And if anybody ever has to protect themselves from any such matter, they're not going to have to worry about having a lawyer. Just call my office. This is the question that he just raises. Who's this all about? Is it about our children? This is Nina Smythe. She's the wife of Cameron Smythe, our assistant. And she has become the president of the chapter of Mothers Against Sexual Predators. And this is what it's about. She's a mother, and I'd like to hear her respond. I just want to say it's Nina Smythe. And I'm a co-founder along with James Watson of Mothers Against Sexual Predators. And I would just like to say that we applaud the judge, we applaud the attorneys for standing up for our kids. Um, as adults, as parents, it's our responsibility to stand up for children because they can't stand up for themselves. And we applaud the judge and the attorneys for standing up against sexual predators like Jack.